All right. We're going to go inside this cave. Um, we're going to go inside of it because it's where we have to go uh, for the game to work. The air feels somehow tense in here. It feels t Ugh. Man, no. Ugh. I almost got my, my, my shit pushed in by one of these already. You and your Pokemon called Quell Hisui's nobles. You can handle any battle. Girl, you have no idea how wrong you are about that. Um, first off, this is a dragon type. If you would like to know what type of Pokemon defeats the dragon type, I'm not the one to ask. Because I don't you know. But I think it's dark. I think it's dark type. But I could be very wrong. Okay. Is that death? Damn near. Oh, I can't attempt to. I, I can't attempt to catch it. Yeah, it, it ain't dark type. Let's see. All right. We're gonna attempt to catch him. Um. I, I really don't know. So, fighting and ground type. Alright. It's almost a level 60. I'm gonna get massacred. But this might help me out. Uh, hopefully it'll miss. It didn't. Well, I have, on many occasions, made a damn fool of myself. This being one of them. Down in Quayhog. It's a water, it's a fire type, it's super dead. He used fucking hydro pump. Of course I died. <laughs> it's fucking sprayed off, it, it sprayed a fire Pokemon with a water hose. I wanna try to catch it. Duh. It shouldn't. I shouldn't kill it. Okay, for me, I ain't got to try to hit it. I will try. Oh my gosh. Rest of the is gonna go out there and get massacred. Uh, I'm gonna keep throwing Pokeballs at it. It has no health! Like. Yeah, of course. It escaped the Pokeball. And I'm only going to be able to... Oh, what? All right, cool. Because it used Strong Style. Get in the Pokeball, please. I Every time you do that, like it feels like it's intentional. Like you're hurting my feelings. Even if you're not trying to, it feels like you're hurting my feelings directly. It's a slight towards me that I don't know if I can deal with. So I'm asking you, please get in the ball. Was my tongue bleeding? It didn't stay in the ball. It 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 it, it killed Vespa Queen. All right, look. Yeah, it's dead. I lost. I got greedy.
I got incredibly gritty. Oh no, they're 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 healed again. I cannot stress enough. Like exactly. Oh well, I can. Yeah. Definitely gonna make a bunch, y'all. This is just forty. Okay. Right. Because Lord knows, I am. Come on. Let's start with Toxicroak. Toxicroak can hit it with the with the whoop whops. Oh, come on, talk, talk. Uh, do I have no? I would literally have to go like power, power levels and fucking Pokemon, and that's it. A strong style, Iron Tail. Don't die, you son of a bitch. I, 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 I specifically asked you not to die. Did you fucking die? Like. Why? Why did you bother? <laughs> All you do is hurt me. was a whole he was the best person he was the best player on the damn thing uh, I just turned my back away I did I can't I can't I can't bear to look oh oh I know what this is gonna be like, I know what's gonna happen. I know what's gonna happen. And what's gonna happen is I'm gonna have to stop. Go power level these Pokemon and just be sad. Because this is the the starting. I mean, it's a level fucking 60. So, we're gonna sit here and we're just gonna get, we're gonna get bodied. First and foremost, I'm gonna just try to paralyze it. Oh. I tried to paralyze it, it clearly didn't work. I was gonna hit him in the If you can keep avoiding those attacks, that fucking Jolly Wrencher cut my tongue. Hmm. Yeah, that's right. Stay over there and get cut. Wow, you didn't kill it? You did good, Vest. You did great. You did great. Don't let anyone tell you any different. You did fantastic. Uh, come on, Queequeg. Queequeg. 
Queequeg. Is there a Mrs. Queequeg? I might kill it, actually. Oh, you missed the... Uh... Okay. So, do me a favor and get in the goddamn Pokeball. I beg it of you. Get in the Pokeball. Stop making me look bad in front of my friends. Get in the Pokeball. Oh, so you just don't care if I look bad in front of my people. That's what's up. Like, this time around, I will murder you. Like, I cannot stress enough. I will fucking kill you. Like, if I come down to, like, the last Pokemon, you don't have enough health left for it to matter who I throw out. I'm going to give you ten of these as best I can. Oh, that's a wrap. I'll just let me watch you die. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, that's the last one. I have two Master Balls left. Well, Ultra Balls, not Master Balls. All right, that's it, dude. If he don't, if, if he don't kill Haunter, and he did. All right. All right. All right. All right. No, that's cool. We got to go. Golly, I think we got to go. I had to press a button to leave anyway. All right. So. Here's what's going to have to happen. I gotta go. I, I I gotta go level up the Poke Boys. Um. All right. Uh, I'm not sure how I can do that. Um, I, yeah, okay. Uh, like, at, like, fucking Abra ain't here. All right, so when I figure out what I can do and what I'm going to do, I'll do it and then be back. Uh, okay. <clears throat> We're going to give this uh, another shot. We have... <laughs> Every time I want to go somewhere else, I have to go here and then go back. Um, I accidentally walked into... Yeah, not this place. This place, this place, and this place all have the, uh, you can literally see, like, the lakes on the, um, on the over screen. Okay, so, we're going to check out the, uh, what you call it, the outbreak first and see what's up. Where's the outbreak at? Ugh. It's right in front of us. So outbreaks are exactly what they sound like. It's just a bunch of Pokemon in one area. <sighs> All right, hold on. 
Just so I ain't tripping. I, I don't know what one looks like. So a real shiny is a little bit darker, like a bit more vibrant blue than the rest of them. And it doesn't seem like... So apparently they're also weak to grab type moves. Good to know. I currently do not have a grass type Pokemon on me. I feel like that might have got us some uh, some halfway decent XP. Okay. <clears throat> uh, 
As far as like the satchels go, like I'll get them on my own time. Uh, but what have I done? Uh, I've learned how the game works a bit better. Um, thinking, thinking, thinking. Uh, I've used, I've utilized the, the rare candy. Uh, utilize the rare candy a bit better and utilize the the grit dust a lot more because raising the effort levels uh, again not something not something relatively common in Pokemon games like I don't I've I've, I've never played Pokemans competitively and I never will like, I don't care that much for it. Uh, okay. So... I really don't know. I don't know. Thunder Punch is an interesting move for him to have. All right. Okay. Forty nine fifty eight. Mind you, this mother has water type moves, and that could be bad business. I deal with a good. Yeah, this will probably be the be a KO. Oh. 
It's curious, but when I watch you in your Pokemon battle, I feel as I feel as if there's no obstacle that can't be overcome if people and Pokemon work together. Now let's see about the Pokemon of the Lake. You feel a mysterious presence. It's it's What in the fart is that? Your emotions. Your emotions run deep. Share them with me. I can only imagine how it must feel to speak directly with a Pokemon like that. When you fell to this land, what stirred in your heart? How did it feel to bond with Pokemon and work together? What did you feel when you mingled with Hisui's clan? I don't know if there's any right or wrong answers. What did you feel when cast out of the galaxy team? Take this piece of the spirit to bind the world once more. That hurt. You got a piece of the goo. You got the plume. Proof that you have completed the trial set by Mesprit and being the being of emotion that lives in Lake Verity. Ver Verity. This is uh this item is needed to forge the red chain. All right. So here's the here's the dealio. So here's the dealio. I know that Pokemon spoke with you. Yet the words did not reach my ears. Hmm. It's mysterious, but I suppose when dealing with someone who fell from the sky, it's only natural to encounter mystery. Next to Lake Valor and Lake Acuity. So here's the deal. I accidentally walked into the cutscene for the lake at... The... Oh. Looks like that worked out well. I must say, you know an awful lot about Hisui. I suppose a merchant like you sees all sorts of things in, in their travels. That's right. You could say it's because I'm a merchant, but mostly because I'm naturally filled with curiosity. I want to know exactly what's happened in the past that led us to this peculiar present. Or more accurately, I suppose, I want to know where I came from and where I'm headed. I want to know my path, so to speak. The same goes for me. Our clan settled in, a ver in the very spot where our forebears, forebears once beheld Almighty Sinnoh. But I... I still have never seen Almighty Sinnoh for myself. Mighty... Weighty matters to ponder for sure. But we have an important task at hand. Do you want to return to, the home, to her home? No. I'm going to stay here for a bit. Then we'll go ahead and see you when you join us. I'm gonna go pick up those um Um
Nigga, it sounds like that wasn't even necessary to be told. That sounds like something a parent would say when, like, y'all don't even know what I sacrificed to make sure y'all get what y'all want, what y'all need. You're right, I don't. As a child, it's really not my business. Whoops. I didn't mean to kill him. At the last possible fucking second. Hmm. Ah, Miss Miss Poon. I don't remember what the voice was. <clears throat> so the legends told it true. So the legends told it true. 
Then the red chain must be real as well. Mm -hmm. I beg your pardon, Kogita. Ma'am. But what do these Pokemon that represent the... Mm -hmm. What does Pokemon that represent the mind have to do with the, this red chain and why? Exactly should it bind the world? Or how would it bind the world is a better question. Uh, your doubt suggests a keen intellect. I see you're not your clan's leader for nothing. For nothing. Without the mind, were the rift to widen in the, the ver uh, and the very world to end, would we even know it? I think sure we'd be aware. One might even say the world, time, space, all, all creation, exists only because our minds are there to perceive it. Perhaps the red chain's purpose is to let one see creation as it truly is. Uh, what? So, does the mind create the world? Or is it the other way around? Or is it... Such a myth, my child. Teaching us about the world in their own incomprehensible ways. They urge us to think more for ourselves on the nature of the almighty Sinnoh and on the nature of the world in which we dwell. You're absolutely right. Myths and legends are, fascin are such fascinating things to study. In any case, all we have to do is complete two more trials and we'll get the red chain. Now, how nonchalant you sound. How confident of success to which you contribute nothing. To which you contribute nothing. You tag along only for the chance to gawk at more ancient ruins. <laughs> um... I don't have This is clearly where it wants us to go. Also, yeah, I found a um <laughs> 